K-Bomb, was this the best game you've ever played? Oh yeah, most of them. By far, best game. What went into that? I just wanted to come out and be aggressive. And I know it starts with me on the defensive end and the offensive end. So I just wanted to come out with tons of energy and just be an aggressive. Hey, Mom, was there a point in the game where you began to really feel like, feel comfortable and feel like, okay, you know, I, can, I can do this? Yeah, I think in the second half, uh, I think when Rodney drove me and gave me the, the pass for the three, I was screaming at Coach Tool, like, let's take over the game, like, let's take over the game. Rodney, how much of a difference did you make you guys Oh, uh, huge difference. When K get it going offensively, you could just tell with the energy spark that we get defensively and offensively, but more importantly on the defensive end, I think when K is hooked up and he's full of energy, everybody else is full of energy, and that encourages us to get more stops. Rodney, after you guys got down for the first time in the second half, how were you able to come back and be up by 10? Uh, I remember when they hit the three, I hit the three, and then they got another three. But it's just all about staying aggressive and uh, not being afraid of the moment. And I think we did a great job of staying together as a team. And uh, every time out, we kept talking to each other like, hey, it's OK. We're going to get it back. We're going to get it back. And then once we got things going, we said we got to step on their throw. We can't let it stay close. Rodney, did it feel like with about 15 minutes to go in the second half, it seemed like you guys kind of got stagnant. Offensively, mm -hmm. and the game might have turned there. Did you feel like that? Yeah, uh, the, that matchup two three or man whatever they go with uh, confuses confused us a little bit, and uh, we were taking quick shots at first and getting a little frustrated. So uh, as the game went on, we started to move the ball more, and once we got the ball popping more, we were able to get better shots. For uh, for uh, you know, uh, you all were playing. Did it kind of seem like as the game got in the final 10 minutes and you guys weren't on that run? Did it seem like it kind of wore them down a little bit? Yeah, a little bit. You know, we did a stat line, you know, as a team, and it showed how many minutes they played. And I believe they played like six more games than any anybody on our team. So, you know, it had to, it had to sink in at some point during the game that, you know, they let us want to get a little shot. But, you know, uh, congratulate them. They played a heck of a game. You know, they stayed with it throughout the end. Um, one of their best players went down, and, you know, that's when we capitalized. And, you know, congratulations to them for the, the amazing season they had. Lucky, can you talk about what K-Ron did today? What did he do? <laughs> <laughs> that's a pretty impressive stat line. <laughs> no, he, he's, uh, you know, uh, mature, he's maturing well. You know, he's uh, doing some incredible things. You know, he's, he's, his body language, you know, the way he's leading us on the court, you know, to make sure guys get to where they need to get to. Uh, you know, myself, when Rodney's not on the court, you know, he's out there directing things. You know, just being the, the point guard and the leader that he is, that he's becoming, um, he, he basically led us today. You know, with them stills, they, they ignited our, you know, transition points. You know, him getting out, getting assists, you know, getting to the free throw line, finally knocking down his free throws. You know, it was a, it was a great game for him. And Lucky, with so much of the scoring focus, you know, was going to you, Rodney, Marquise. I mean, what does it mean to have Kayvon step up and, and be that point person in a 14? Oh, it just proves what we've, we've been saying all, all, all this year. You know, we're a great team. You know, team first. You know, together, everyone achieves more. And tonight, one of our teammates, you know, stepped up big time for us. And obviously, Ronnie, myself, and uh, Marquise didn't shoot it very well. But at the end of the day, you know, our most important thing was getting to the championship. And uh, we get to celebrate this one. But for the next for the next 24 hours, but then we got to make sure we understand what's about to happen next next week. You know, we just got to prepare and you know make sure we stay detailed. Well, going on that a little bit, this will be the third time in four years you play in. Game coming out, obviously, that's your second. What's the message for you, the legacy you're playing right now, to your guys that, that you need to be on track to figure out this game and do that? Stay together. Um, you know, my freshman year, it was a it was a great season. You know, I didn't ever experience an atmosphere, and, and you 
know, the things that was happening so fast. And obviously, one of our best players, one of the best players from our Moors that ever played here, Ellen Jones McDonough, it wasn't like, you know, we, we was together. You know, everybody has fell and, you know, things didn't work together. You know, obviously, last year, obviously the better team won, but, you know, we, we didn't stay together and we only had, you know, so many people that we could depend on. And this year, I think this is probably our best chance to win a championship. You know, we got a lot of depth, we got a lot of athleticism, you know, we got a, a lot of heart. And uh, this year, I think we're more together than any team that we had, uh, that's been here the, uh, the last four years. Lucky, when you were going through the handshake line and, and hot starts, that's quite a lengthy hot. Would he say anything to you about it? No, we, we just, uh, you know, talked it up for a little bit, you know, just congratulating on his amazing success that he had. You know, coming here as a sophomore at NEC, you know, nobody thought that he was going to be the kind of score he had become. Um, I just wanted to congratulate him on first team and, you know, all the success that he brought to his team. And uh, that's about it. Any other questions for Well, you guys are just missing. See you on Tuesday. Okay, well.